couple weeks ago, I saw on Fishing Tackle Retailer, mm-hmm. our boy uh, Ken Duke's website. Yeah, I saw the new. I saw online the that that uh, live bait was coming out with these new bait ball spinner baits, and I thought, well, you know, we're always looking for new products to get on here, do a little review of this one. I could probably get to me early, fish with it, be able to do a little bit, have a little more knowledge about the product, and then we can come on here and talk about it. I was going to have it on last week, but uh, John I, Cox is in studio. John Cox is in studio. I mean, we truly, way busy. I, we, last week was talking about his juice and yeah. Everything, I mean, so. it was it yeah. was slammed. Slammed. Now, if you haven't seen the new live target lures, they're absolutely beautiful lures to start off with. They're they're phenomenal bu- lures. Uh, I didn't get these free. I went. I've been purchasing all these things I get on here, um, but as you can see, it's almost like. An Alabama rig, to be honest. It's like a small Alabama rig. Um, they are, they come in, I think I, I think I saw there online, they come in like uh, eight different colors, but they run perfect. I mean, they run perfect. And the problem that I always thought with Alabama rigs is first they didn't let them in the tournaments. Right. But... As a spinner bait, you, are, you either have a spinner bait that has one, two, three different blades to it, and that has the reaction of a bunch of bait running through the water. These have that same reaction, but they also have the thumper, little thumper tails on them. So you're getting like the action of the fish moving side to side as you're running it through the water, and they have a little iridescent thing in the middle of the smaller baits that make them shine like it's an extra blade. Right. So when you throw it, it looks like as it's coming towards you, it's it's four smaller baits and one a little bit bigger bait that it, that's that's doing everything to attract a bass from the the shine of the extra what they think is a blade to the thumping tails. And it, it comes in this is a three eighths ounce. So this isn't a heavy jig for you to throw. Mm-hmm. When you have those Alabama rigs, one of the problem is is that they're they're insanely heavy to to throw i mean you got to have like a heavy duty rod to throw those things and again they're illegal in most fishing tournaments right this is perfect it's lightweight it has the same shine as your normal your normal spinner baits and even more has the thumper tails they look fantastic they look very cool they do look good is the aerodynamics good for cast yes does it cast well it casts Really well. Okay. It doesn't like flumble in the midair. You know, you throw. Sorry, you throw it, and it kind of does one of those side right. side That's things. What I was wondering. This doesn't do it. Now, I will say, if I have to be honest about this, this one that I have right here, I've caught four fish on. Four fish because I didn't catch. I didn't use this on Tuesday. I was using this on Tuesday till I saw Big Mama. Yeah. You know that one. That uh, one there. That one right there. They come in, 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 in eight colors. Eight colors? Eight colors. But this bait, I had, I had caught four fish on before I caught Big Mama. And this, don't, my only complaint was I threw this and I was casting right up against a, um, how do I want to put it? Uh, uh, I was I was underneath an underpass. Okay. I guess that's the best way for me to say it. I bounced it off of the, 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 the wall. Okay. And it bent on the on this part on the main part and it didn't run right after that now i didn't realize it didn't run right and brought it in and then cast it again and then went oh i can feel a difference in how it's running through the water so i brought it back in and just bent it back with my hands it's not like a titanium thing you can bend these they're they're bendable yeah right now the price on this is now i bought these on bass pro or BassPro.com, or i might have got them on tackle warehouse maybe they were about twelve bucks each, twelve forty nine for each one. I got the silver one because I thought that looked like mostly like what I'm throwing, what I'm using to, to get to throw at. But also bought the gold shiner. Now I sh- you should mention, I should mention that the smaller baits are replaceable, so you could put on, a, a, the gold one like we have here, or a silver or green or any of the colors that they have. They are replaceable. It's a beautiful, beautiful, and this is a gold blade. The other one is the silver blade. It's a beautiful bait. Um, and I hadn't seen it really, honestly. I haven't seen it. I go to Brooker's at least twice a week right now. First off, because I think the guys at Brooker's are amazing. They're knowledgeable. 
They have all these little. They they cook for everybody. Yeah. They just are just good people. It's in locally owned. They're really good people. I mean, really, they are. So I go up there and I hang out for about ten or fifteen minutes talking about fishing. They have. You want to? They. I just go in, sit down on a bench, and just talk to the old guys. And I have I have been having a great time doing it. I'm right. learning some other things about you can learn some stuff. The Harris chain, sure. yeah. I mean, they're good. They're good anglers, uh, but they have they didn't have them, so that's why I bought them online. So, but if you want a g- good, if you want to try something different, and you have all those small fish or you got these things, you want to check out these Live Target, the bait. It's called the Live Target Bait Ball Spinner Baits. I think you'll be pretty impressed. They're phenomenal looking baits. I mean, they look awesome, man. I mean, look at that thing. It does look good. I have and and really, three eighths ounce. I mean, you can throw that on any rod. That's the best thing about them. So, yeah. check that out. Now, 